In the world of boxing, one name stands out above the rest, Don King, a master promoter, a legendary figure, but behind the glitz and glamour lies the darker truth. As one former said, I trusted Don King, he promised me the world, but what I got was a raw deal. And from another boxer that said he manipulated contracts, stole money, he was a snake in the grass. Now there's also commentary from sports journalists that say Don King had a ruthless reputation for cheating fighters. One of Don King's favourite tactics was burying unfair clauses in contracts ensuring he received the lion's share of the profits leaving boxers with scraps. Many boxers found themselves trapped in legal battles they couldn't win facing off against Don King's high-priced lawyers. But perhaps the most insidious aspect of Don King's reign was his ability to manipulate the media and control the narrative. He knew how to charm reporters and spin stories in his favour, painting himself as a benevolent benefactor of the sport. But behind the scene, boxers were being cheated out of rightful earnings, their dreams shattered by a man they once trusted. For every champion Don King helped create, there were countless others left in his wake. Their careers ruined by greed and deception. Now one known figure is Mike Tyson. Tyson became one of the most feared and celebrated boxers in history, but behind the scene, a darker tale unfolded. In the late 80s and early 90s, Tyson rose to become one of the great boxers in his time. Under King's guidance, Tyson became an undisputed heavyweight champion of the world a boxing phenomenon unlike any other. As Mike Tyson once said, Don was like a father figure to me. He always had my back, always looked out for me, but the reality was completely different. But as Mike, as Tyson's star continued to rise, cracks began to appear in the relationship between Mike Tyson and Don King. As one former entourage member said, Don was always playing games behind the scene. He'd promise one thing and deliver another. And as another said, Tyson under his thumb manipulated him, took advantage of his trust. It soon became clear that Tyson's lucrative deals with Don King were heavily skewed in the promoter's favor. Tyson would later accuse King of cheating him out of millions of dollars, allegedly fraudulent contracts and underhand tactics. Their relationships soured, leading to bitter feud that overshadowed Tyson's late, later years in boxing. In the end, Tyson's legacy was marred by his association with Don King, a cautionary tale of how power and greed can corrupt even the greatest of champions. And while Tyson's boxing career may have ended, the controversy surrounding his deals with Don King will ever forever cast a shadow over his legacy. In the end, Don King's legacy will forever be tainted by the lives is destroyed and the trust is betrayed. Now it's not all doom and gloom for boxers. There is a happy ending to this story as we all discuss in Ali's Law and how it goes about protecting boxers. Muhammad Ali, a boxing legend, an icon of courage and conviction, but beyond his achievements in the ring, Ali left her behind a legacy that continues to protect boxers to this day. Ali's passion for boxers was matched only by his dedication to ensure that fighters receive their fair share of treatment and protection. Ali's Law, let's discuss it. Also known as Muhammad Ali Boxing Reform Act enacted in 2000 and it brought significant changes. To amongst this provision, Ali's Law mandates transparency in promotional contracts, prohibiting promoters from having a direct or in direct financial interest in the boxers' management. Ali's law has become a game changer for boxers. It shows that boxers have more control over their career and less likely to be taken advantage of by unscrupulous boxers. By safeguarding boxers' rights and promoting Ali's, by promoting fair competition, Ali's law honors the legacy of Muhammad Ali and protects the integrity of the sport he loved. And as boxing continues to evolve, Ali's law remains a beacon of hope for fighters around the world, ensuring that they are treated with respect and the dignity they deserve. There you are guys, a solution to a problem which protects boxers. Ali's law gives confidence that they cannot be cheated out of their hard-earned cash and makes current and future promoters think twice. Unfortunately, the same cannot be said for the UFC fighters who are underpaid and treated poorly. Check out this video we have discussed the pay earnings between UFC and boxers and there's a huge significant difference and if you haven't already I really appreciate it if you subscribe and share this YouTube video and I'll see you in the next one.